Welcome back YouTube to my first ever playthrough of Mass Effect 2. Last night we started the game, it was an absolutely epic opening. I was not expecting the two year coma situation. That really took me by surprise. Now we're on the Citadel. We have got Miranda and Jacob here who are limbering up because we're about to go and do a heist with Kasumi. So thank you so much for being here and let's get straight into it. So, master thief Kasumi Goto has a problem. A ruthless arms dealer named Donovan Hawk killed her partner, Keiji Okuda, and stole Okuda's grey box, a neural implant that stores memories and information. Kasumi has planned a daring heist to recover Okuda's grey box and has asked for help in pulling it off. Once this is done, Kasumi can dedicate all her attention to completing Shepard's mission. Travel to Beckenstein, Boltzmann, Serpent Nebula, let's remember that, and attend the party of notorious arms dealer, Donovan Hawk. This is all sounding very cyberpunk. I feel like I'm about to go and meet the Mass Effect version of Kurt Hansen, which I am absolutely fine with. The Citadel's looking well. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Kelly, yesterday things got a bit weird between us. Earlier when we spoke, you were very open with me. I like that, but I hope I didn't come across as too flirty. I don't want to overstep my bounds. Dude, nobody has, nobody, like, Caden has not looked for me. One bit. Kaden hasn't looked for me. Where is he? I thought Kaden would be like, I will search the galaxy and the stars trying to find Shepard. And I haven't heard anything from that man. You're very charming, Kelly. Thank you. The feeling is mutual. Anyway, <laughs> how may I help you, Commander? Let's chat. Do you have a moment to talk? I always have time for you, Commander. I think I've already asked her all these questions. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. Maybe we will. She said that I had a new message at my personal something. Oh my god, I have text messages. Samesh Bhatia? Oh, I can't believe he got in touch with us again. I wish to again express my thanks for your assistance in retrieving my wife's body. Oh, that makes me happy. Beckenstein, help Kasumi. Let's go. Kasumi. Okay, we can level up Kasumi a little bit. She looks like, yeah, Master Thief needs to be upgraded a lot. Shadow strike. Cloak and sneak behind a target. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Shepard has no more points to use. Okay. Let's see what this girl's up to. Looking good, Miss Allison Gunn. Oh. Hawk won't be able to keep his eyes off you. Oh, we're in the dress. I assume Allison Gunn is my cover. You run a small but talented band of mercs out in the Terminus systems. Precisely oh, Shepard looks so good. Respects. I took the liberty of giving you a reputation. Papers, witnesses, article in Badass Weekly. I love this lip makeup. Just don't start talking business with him and you'll be fine. Hawk's a weapons dealer and smuggler. <gasps> this he is killed so my Kurt Hansen coded. Box. Other than that, he's not so bad. Rich, charismatic. Willing to crack open a man's skull to get at the neural implants inside. What is with the outfit? Get up for a reason. You'd look really out of place at a society party in armor, don't you think? You look great. You should wear this stuff more often. I like Kasumi. Now's probably a good time to fill me in on the details. You have been waiting patiently. Oh. Our friend Hawk is throwing a party for his closest. Here we go. Friends. Here we go. A couple dozen of the worst liars, cheaters, and mass murderers you'll ever want to meet. All bringing gifts as a tribute to the man himself. Is that him there? He's not as hot as Kurt Hansen. Our tribute is a lovely statue of your old friend <gasps> Saren. Wow. Rendered with loving detail and filled to the brim with our weapons and armor. You can mm. keep your pistol as long as it's concealed. They won't hassle you over a sidearm. Once inside, we'll make our way to Hawk's vault door, somewhere in the back Why of the Why are we giving ballroom. him a statue then, of Saren? <laughs> case the security and start peeling away the layers. The statue should be there, waiting for you to crack it open and arm up. Then we just waltz into the vault and take back KG's gray box. Easy peasy. And get a chance to say goodbye. This isn't just another heist. You worked really hard on this. KG must have meant a lot to you. Was I that obvious? KG's gray Aww. box holds a lot of priceless personal memories. It's all that remains of who he was. But, but the she secret got really he discovered dark is dangerous. 
I wouldn't bring you here if it wasn't. Better be worth it. What's in the gray box that makes it worth all this trouble? The gray box holds Keiji's memories. Everything from all the codes and plans he stole to Aww. all the time we spent together. Wrapped okay, this means a lot. Why are we getting this boob shot of Shepard? Keiji never told me what it was, but the information got him killed. <laughs> God damn it. This ought to be interesting. That's what I'm going for. Okay, I like Kasumi. I like her motive for wanting to get this box back. Let's hope there's no... Uh, what is the this word? Is stop. I don't want any betrayals here. After you, Ms. Gunn. So my name is Ms. Gunn. Hold a moment, ma'am. There seems to be an issue with the statue. Uh-oh. We might have fell at the is first hurdle here. There he yeah. is, the man himself, no, Hawk. Just doing a scan. I don't believe we've met. Donovan Hawk. Nice to meet. I hope she puts on her sexy voice. I've heard a lot about you. Name's Allison Gunn. And though I've heard a lot about you, you've been very busy lately, if the extra net is to be believed. He didn't Sir, even shake our hands. The scanners aren't picking anything up. What a rude bastard. <sighs> Don't think our guests would come all the way here from Ilium just to cause trouble. South they African? Do. I don't think our guests would you come all the through, way from Ilium. You were invited after all, but I will ask his companion accent. to remain outside. You understand, I hope. Oh no, we have a problem here, sir. Can you explain why my friend has to stand outside? That's so I don't awkward. Like the look of your friend so she stays outside. Simple as that. This is a very, a, a blended accent, right? <laughs> I kind of love it though. If that's what it takes. I'm going to be a little bit sassy because he knows my reputation. If it makes you feel more secure, she can wait outside. Good to see we're not going to have a problem. I love Enjoy it. Enjoy the I party. Well, that didn't go as I expected. Maybe because you're in armor. Like why have you put me in this dress to blend in and you're in a full suit of armor and a hood? <laughs> Any idea why he'd send you away? No, we've never seen each other in person, and no one knows what I look like. Well, yeah, Just watching his ass, I'm that's sure. why you're suspicious I as hell. What do we do now? We go on with the plan. You'll just have to do all the talking. I'll stay out of sight and stick with you the best I can. All right. There goes Saren. We'll Isn't Shepard like one of the most famous people in the wrong. world? We need to find the door and case the security. Figure out the next step then. I'm obsessed with this already. Locate the vault door. Look at her all dressed up. She looks awesome. That's true. People do think Shepard is dead, so maybe they wouldn't even think twice that it might be her. Let's see who's around here. Here's a security door. Sounds that goes to a security room. We'll probably have to get in there at some point. Let's case the vault and figure out what we have to do. Okay. We should speak to Hawk again, I think. He's gone. He's we gone. need to case the vault, gun. You can chat up Hawk later. All right. Oh! Wow. He's making it too expensive Arc to do Angel. business Omega. Though I hear some mercs are coming together to deal with it. <gasps> oh, this looks like a secret vault. Surprise, there's no guards down here. I think we found it. Very nice. There's more here than I expected. There's Saren. I bet Shepard feels a bit sad looking at Saren. Barrier, DNA scanner, looks like an EX700 series. Everything a vault needs to be impenetrable. This gonna be a problem? Please, remember who you're talking what to. What does male Shep wear in we'll this quest? We'll need to get a voice for the voice Does he vault. suit up? You'll have to go chat up Hawk for that. We'll have to find a password too. DNA, child's play. We should find plenty of DNA samples in Hawk's private quarters. And the barrier? Cut the power. Never fails. If we can find it, Keiji could get through a system like this in his sleep. And I'm better. He wears the dress too. To <laughs> okay, so we have a few jobs to do. A substantial sample of Hawk's genetic material. So we need to find that in his room. We'll go try to do that one first. I need to chat up this man. Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. I have authorization. I have clearance to go in. On whose authority? Whoa. 
Maybe I shouldn't have said this. Hawk gave me permission to go in. Hawk knows procedure. You're not getting in till I hear it from my commander. Okay. Enjoy the party. No Try problem. We need to get in there. That's the best place to find Hawk's DNA. Let's have a chat with Hawk. Maybe we can get his voice. Getting past the lock will require both knowledge of the password and a sample of the voice. Okay, so we need to get the password and speak with him long enough to obtain a sample of the voice. Okay, chat to me. There he is. All you need to do is keep him talking long enough for me to get a voice print. Pull I love this kind of quest. Whenever you're ready. After you. Ms. Gunn, good to see you. Now he shakes the my hand. The door hasn't soured your evening, I hope. Expecting trouble? I understand the security, but who would dare try to break into Donovan Hawk's home? Gun, in our line of work, we attract a certain element. Few understand the pains we take to keep the barbarians at bay. People oh, this these accent days is comfort, wild. Entertainment, He's love. throwing that glass of wine they around. They see that the galaxy is fragile. They only have to worry about simple luxuries. Why? Because people like me and you are doing the terrible things that keep the galaxy spinning. Keep him this talking. This party is for us. The cleaners. The support structure for the galaxy's gleeful delusions of peace. May there always be a market for the things we do. Very good. Woo! I said get him talking, and you got him talking. We've got enough of a voice sample. Let him go. Enjoy Easy. The party, Miss Gunn. Once we find the password, we can get past the voice scatter. That seemed too easy, right? Okay, let me see if we can speak to this guy on the bedroom door again. Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. I have clearance to go in. On whose authority? That little look up and down from Shepard is amazing. Through. Turn around now, or I call for backup. Fine. Enjoy the party. There's got to be a way to get in there. Let's look around. Oh, I never noticed there was a little outdoor area. A data pad? Private reams. No way we can sneak out of that party. The place is locked down tight and security chief Ro's in charge. No way Ro would let that get past her. I'd rather stand around board on guard duty than risk her wrath. Chief Ro, huh? She sounds like a hot ass. If we could tap into the guards' communications, I could probably use this information. Tap into the guards' communications, okay. Here, Mr. Hawk's vault is exquisite. Who could know? He never lets anyone near it. Sneak into the private quarters, look. Here we go. <gasps> Whoa, Shepard! <gasps> we. Oh my God! Get ready. <laughs> Was that scream coming from the guy that just fell over the edge? Because that's so funny. <laughs> Can we sneak in up here? can't jump. What am I missing here? I feel like that's telling me to go up here, no? What have I done wrong, Kasumi? Kasumi, help me. Don't, we can't jump. Oh? Thick. <laughs> That's not a usual thing we do, no. Interesting. Just make it quick and quiet. <laughs> Found a sample? No, a credit shit. Hmm. No DNA, but looks like Hawk's been trying to crack cages. Wine glass, box. come on. Looks like he's missing something. He hasn't cracked the encryption yet. Not a great saliva sample, but it's still useful. We're going to need more than this for the scanner, though. Ashtray. Empty. Too bad. A cigarette butt would have been a good source. The plant? Why would there be DNA on the plant? It's clean. It's a plant. <laughs> it's a plant. <laughs> Let me play this game real quick. I clicked the wrong thing. Let me try again, though. I'm good at this game. 
<gasps> I can only try it once! No! I fumbled that so bad. Oh well. The cleaners don't dare touch treasures like this. We can get some skin cells from the dust. It's probably contaminated though. We should find another sample. Keyboard, perfect. Holographic interface. Oh. <laughs> Won't find a sample here. God damn it. Good morning. Time to wake up. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Here they come. No, this is supposed to be a heist. It's supposed to be stealthy. Going dark. Well done. I think we got them. That is bad. Any more out there? Pillow, pillow, pillow. No hair, no what? skin flakes. The housekeepers must be thorough. Little progress to report. We have now completed dictionary attacks using words and phrases from 4,800 galactic languages. Research into the Okuda family has not produced any matches. It is unlikely that a random brute force approach will produce a result within our lifetimes. Given the nature of the gray box technology, it's possible that the decryption key may not be a password at all. It could be a memory, an emotion, even a smell. The permutations could be infinite. I suggest that we begin investigating alternative methods for breaking through the security on the box. We can probably get Hawk's DNA off the data pad. He seems to have obsessed over this. That should do it. Let's get out of here. Yeah, I mean, there's dead guards everywhere now. <gasps> the guard's gone. It must be one of the guys that I killed. Oops. Okay, I don't know what the password is yet. DNA identification affirmed. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. Welcome, thank you. We need the password. Let's look for a security console we can hack for info. Okay, security console. What does one of them look like? This? Security console, security console. It looks like the barrier's power cable runs under the floor here. I'll set your Omni tool to scan for electromagnetic fields. Oh, oh. Okay, so that's what powers this door. Careful. The barrier's still up. We'll have to shut it down to get to the door. Okay, that's fine. So follow this tube. Oh, it's very subtle. I like that. Through the wall, down, round the fountain. Hello, Hawk. He's gone. Hello. Through this wall. One sec. Oh, shit. Nice. Take care of the Okay, the barrier's done. We just need to find the password now. She said that we need to find a security console to hack, so... Where would we have a security console? Maybe... Mm, there's a security room back here that we walked past earlier when we first arrived. So let's see if we can get in there, now that the guards are gone. Let me unlock that security Thank you, Kasumi. There we go. Thanks, girl. Ready when you are. Oh, stop doing that. <gasps> I got this. I got this. There we go. Yee! Holy shit. You can't be back here. Take him down. Ah. Moving to cover. Ah. Watch where you are. Ah. Nice, Kasumi. I have an idea. We've killed so See many. What you can find. Okay, we've got the password, everyone. I have that problem too. So many passwords around here, I can't keep them straight. The password for tonight is Perugia. So it's not even that easy to remember. It's no big deal. The voice scanner the voice scanner means the password's only useful to Hawk anyway. After the party, let's grab some beers. So Perugia, let's remember that. Got something? Yeah, we got it. The password is Perugia. Perugia, huh. sorry. That's the name of the man who stole the Mona Lisa. Oh, nice. nice. Now, I just take the voice sample we got from Hawk and... Got it. Now we can crack that voice scatter. Let's go. Oh, what are you doing up there? Okay, let's continue. Let's go. I'm excited now. I feel like all hell's gonna break loose when we get into this room, though. Surely. This dude. Hawk throws a hell of a party. Yes. I'm not too pleased with the caliber of people he's invited, though. Oh, <laughs> that's awkward. 
That got it. The barrier's down. Password required. Perugia. Voice ID accepted. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. Let's go. I'll check for security cams. Go ahead and get dressed. Go ahead and get dressed. There's my outfit! Yay! We have all of our stuff. Are we gonna go kill everyone? I thought we were just here to retrieve something. Shepard looks a lot more comfortable in her outfit now, doesn't she? Here we go, Kasumi. So this was a heist. We've already killed several guards and now we've got our armor on. And it looks like things are about to get serious. He has loads of statues of things, so which this is quite is odd. Fault. Very nice. This scanner will hone in on the gray box. It's not far. Okay, the proximity is 31. Creepy. Protheans! Creepy. Egyptian statue? I could still get money for something like this, even outside the Alliance. Asari go nuts for this sort of thing. That's impressive. Not sure what it is, though. This is- Whoa! Hold on a second! How did I miss this? This is the head of the Statue of Liberty? From New York City? What? How did Hawk get Lady Liberty's head? Damn you, Hawk! That's insane. This guy's got a crazy collection. We That's found it, though. the Casa Locust. No. The Casa Locust. The gun that killed two presidents. <gasps> Gorgeous. It even comes with a perfect copy, too. The gun that killed two sure presidents? Hawk won't mind if we borrowed these. This should come in handy. The following squad members are now able to use this weapon. Shepard, Miranda, and Kasumi. But this is the grey box here, right? Oh my god. We've got there it. it is. Don't bother Miss Goto. It's cold locked. Whoa! I had a feeling that was you at the door. I knew if it was really you, you'd get through anyway. This accent you know me. is wild. I don't like to disappoint. I need what's in your grey box, Kasumi. Your grey box. You know I'm willing to kill you for it. I'll admit your skills are impressive. You got into my vault like I'd left it open. But you're still going to die, screaming, just like your old friend. Oh, I missed an opportunity to do try. something bad and I regret, I regret not doing it. This is where your special skills come into play, Shepard. Let's do this. Here we go, everyone. We've got company. Now you see me. <laughs> oh. Oh, I out. love the grenade launcher. That is brilliant. Chief Row. Oh, holy shit, what's that? Checking blueprints. There's a landing pad to the east. Let's get out of here. Okay, Joker, let's go. Bring the shuttle in now. The Prothean statue's kind of cool, right? I, I wasn't really sure what Protheans looked like, but there we go. Lots of Krogan statues in here. There's one of the Rachni. All right, let's get out of here, girl. Oh. Holy shit! Oh, a man! Kasumi! Going dark. Go, girl. Nice, Kasumi! I have to be careful that I don't run out of ammo. Because that's a thing now. That looks like a big Mako. 
find matching code segments, locate and select the code that matches the code displayed. Avoid red codes. <gasps> what? I missed it. I froze. I didn't know what I was supposed to do. Let me try once more. This is hard. No. Oh, this is really difficult. I did it! Okay, I think I understand now. I wasn't supposed to hit the red sections at all. Let's keep going. Here they are. Get ready. Let's, ah! Let's try it then. That is so cool! I'm obsessed. Sorry, friends. I'm not sure I understand the charge right now. I'm not sure I'm ready to wield its power right now. That was very shocking and alarming, and I wasn't sure what I was supposed to do. Volatile tanks. Do we need to blow up the volatile tanks? Or are we just doing it for fun? Oh my god. Oh my god. That guy. Yep. Don't let them out of there with mine. Don't let them out of there with my property. Kill Allison Gunner. Bring the other. We got him. Whoa, you nearly got me with your rocket. You did nearly get me. And fought me, Kasumi. You know what happened to your boy boy when he fought back. I'll hate you like that. Murderer. <gasps> he just threatened her. What are you shooting? Keep them busy. I'll take care of this myself. I'll take care of this myself. Going down. Oh, nice! Sorry, got up. Oh, there we go. <laughs> I love missions like this. It's like zombies. Just bring on the hordes. I'm so ready. I think those are just resources I can collect. I don't know if there's much significance to them at the moment, but no harm in collecting them, I guess. Her shepherd still can't jump, even in Mass Effect 2. As long as we got what we came for. Oh, here we go. Did we make it? Or, sh or where is Joker? Uh oh. That doesn't sound like the normal thing. Incoming! Get down! Holy shit! You could have done this the easy way, Goldberg. Allow me to show you the hard way. The hard way. I know! Look left! I don't think I can shoot this thing down. It's a whole fucking planet. I have one grenade left. Better make it count. Where did that go? <laughs> I can't use any powers on that thing, can I? Why is his shield going up? What did you tell your friend, Kazumi? You're doing this for love? Why did his shield just go all the way back up? Target is immune to the Vanguard charge, unfortunately. Even if you escape, I'll scour the galaxy for you. Gun to the back and with full shield. I can get to the ship. I can take down the shield. Oh! Careful, men. What the keeper bit you by the head? Ugh! Creep! 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 Go, 
Kasumi. Go, 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 girl. What a shit about to do. Spider-Man 2? This is Let's not Spider-Man 2. Go, girl. Kasumi really said Uno reverse. Too late to get out of this alive, Kasumi. Kaboom, your ship blew up. Is that it? <laughs> Is that him gone? I thought we would have got like a cutscene or something being like, woohoo, girl power, we got him. <laughs> this little shuttle has come to pick us up to bring us back home though, so let's see. We have the grey box. Oh, is that him? Oh, is that him? Kasumi, if you're seeing this, no. it's because I'm dead. The Akuda. information we found is all here. It's big, Kasumi. Aww. If the Council ever got wind of this, the Alliance could be implicated. Kasumi, I... I encrypted the information to keep it safe. Look at all their memories together the as well. To your gray box. <gasps> he has a little beard so like no her lipstick. But if I'm dead, and if anyone knows about this, then I've made you a target, my love. I'm so, so sorry. Keiji. Oh. I know you, Kasumi. You'll want to keep these memories forever. But you don't need some neural implant to know I'll always be with you. Please, Kasumi. Oh. Destroy these files. There's nothing more I can do to protect you. I, I can't do that. This is all that's oh, left. Oh, bless her. Goodbye, Kasumi. I love you. Oh, that's horrible. Oh, that's really sad. Is there any way we can just destroy the information? No. Keiji's a master at encrypting files. He laced the information into his memories. You can you still remember them. Without experiencing the other. Keep the box or destroy the box. It's what he wants. I don't know. I feel like I shouldn't tell her what to do. I feel like I should just tell her to do what she thinks. It's not up to me, I don't think. I'm going to say it's what he wants. You heard him, Kasumi. He'd want you to destroy the information and save yourself. I know. I just... I can't. You'll still be able to remember him. This is all that's left of him. Let me do it. If it's easier, I could do it for you. I... Oh. Okay. Just get it over with. Please. Bless her. Goodbye. You can still remember him without the the memories on the box. the dress on still let's go see if joker has anything nice to say about my nice outfit somebody better commander the good old days think about the old normandy and the trouble we get up to 
Yeah, those seem like the good old days now, but come on, it was hell at the time. Get, true. Saren, Sovereign, and then we got dumped. That's very true. We're stuck in a weird place, sure, but back then it wasn't all sunshine and bunnies. What happened to the rest of the old crew? Yes. I heard most Where's survived. Where's that go? Almost did. Presley, Presley didn't. didn't. And the rest of us just sort of drifted apart. That's so sad. Didn't care. I don't think they liked all the non-humans in your crew. We were your team, Commander. Oh, that's With the awful. Normandy destroyed and you gone, there wasn't much keeping us together. That's so sad. I assume everything's going well up here? I really want a chance to put the Normandy through her paces. I just have to okay. turn off the drive output and it'll be like we never lost her. Safety standards advise against manipulating drive settings while engines are powered and in use, Mr. Moreau. Commander, can we shut this thing off? I don't need it in my day to day. No, you need to be friends with AD. I'm no fan either, but we're stuck with it. Until I find a soldering gun. There's gotta be some oh. wires I can cross to make it hurt. Oh. No sabotage. <laughs> Understood? Yeah, yeah, don't break the boss's toys. Goodbye. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Is no one gonna mention my smoking hot dress? Kittenwood. Oh, wow. <gasps> Kasumi! People are talking out there. And I hear it all. Oh. Liquor? Oh, shit. Whoa, <laughs> those fluid physics were funny. I will have another drink. The poor mechanics are so funny. Are we gonna be too drunk? The way she like shakes her head like, oh no! I'm gonna be sick. Oh no! Don't laugh, I like those books. She likes romance, romance novels. novels. Crime novels, the classics. There's something about I the feel feel Ill. actual paper in your hands. Their musty smell. It's relaxing. Keiji used to find books for me while on the job. Some of these are more valuable than the objects he was hired to steal. Kasumi's really, really sweet. I really appreciate your help with the Hawk Heist. I know why we had to destroy Keiji's gray box. But it doesn't make it any easier. You take your time. You don't need to rush. Miranda's office. Let's see if she has anything to say. Hey, girl. Commander, what can I do for you? What can do I do for you? Miranda? Of course. I'm just finishing an operation report. I'm impressed, Shepard. So far, things have gone exceptionally well. No, she seems nice. As Cerberus operations go, this is one of the best I've been a part of. Cerberus obviously has your loyalty. How did you get involved with them? I suppose you've earned the right to Miranda know. Miranda would sh would definitely say something I told about you the how dress. I was genetically altered. Well. That wasn't my choice. My father created me. He's a very influential man and extremely controlling. He didn't want a daughter. He wanted a dynasty. Oh. I ran away as soon as I was old and brave enough. I went to Cerberus because I knew they could protect me. That's sad. She's like created for a purpose and not just to live. How bad were the terms you and your father parted on? Shots were fired. Oh. You seem capable of defending yourself. Why did you need Cerberus? My father invested a great deal in his dynasty. It wasn't a matter of just leaving. I knew he would continue to pursue his... investments. I assume that Cerberus approves of your enhanced abilities? Of course. Of Cerberus course, yeah, of course they do. That advances the cause of humanity. Genetic alterations included. But unlike my father and his own selfish reasons, Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture, and I feel like I have a purpose here. Father, let me learn about your mother. You told me a lot about your father. What happened to your mother? I never had one. Most of my Aww. genetic material is based on my father's tissue. His Y chromosome was altered with an amalgam of desired traits from various wow. sources. Oh, she's a literal How test tube be? baby. The man is completely egomaniacal. Just another reason I had to get away from him. Self esteem. You talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used. By your father? By Cerberus? Maybe. I like to know where I fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. Aww. You are who you are, Miranda. You don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to say. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. Yeah, the no. difference is, you were great before we rebuilt you. No. I'm great because of it. 
Oh, this is kind of sad. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. Exactly. It's what makes anyone great. That's kind of you. I'm not sure I believe you, but thanks for saying it. Oh, bless her. Who exactly is your father? A businessman, but a very wealthy one. It's ironic. My father believed deeply in a human positive agenda. He donated generously to Cerberus before I joined them. That's Ooh. how I first heard about Cerberus, through my father's connections. And now he... Is he still alive? I wonder, is her dad still alive? Maybe I missed something. I don't think she mentioned it. Thanks for your time, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, Commander. I know she said shots were fired. I don't know if she meant literally. Like, did she... fire shots... at him? Literally or figuratively? That's all the talking I want to do for now. So, we have quite a few other things still to do. Look how much stuff we've done already. Wow! The Alliance has found the wreckage of the SSV Normandy on the planet Alchera. They have asked that a monument be placed on the site and any sign of the remaining 20 missing crew members to be recovered. I feel like it would be, it would be the next thing that I would do, naturally. Come on, Joker. All right, we want to go to Omega. Have found something. Oh. Scan confirms the wreckage of the SSV Normandy on the planet's surface. No life signs or mechanical activity detected. Oh, here we go in our brand new Normandy. out the door into like the main area and it's all outside so you haven't do like a space walk through what used to be like the main hub of the ship that was crazy kid and elenko oh <gasps> the man goes in i was about to say kid and elenko should be here waiting for me in case i ever return but there's the Mako, my child. I like that I'm just exploring this bit on my own. We don't bring a team with us. This is something we have to do alone. Dog tags? No, please. Carolyn Granado. This is so sad. The Mako. Baby. My child. Oh, we have a monument ready to plant. Oh, that's gorgeous. Shepard just had that in her back pocket the whole time, I think. That's so beautiful. More dog tags. Silas Crosby. More dog tags. Harvey J. Gladstone. There's 20 of these things to collect. Wow. Amina Waberi. Mandira Raman. What is in here? Talitha Draven. Is Talitha the one that we talked down from the ledge? I thought Talitha was the one that was also from Mindwar and she kind of lost her mind a little bit. And she was going to shoot herself, but we stopped her. This is the cockpit. This is where we used to exit. Maybe she wasn't serving. Maybe she was just getting a ride home. Rosamond Draven. This is so sad. What did they do to my ship? 
Abhishek Pakti. Robert Falawa. Raymond Tanaka. We've got 10. Okay, we keep looking, man. We've got to find everyone's. Yeah, the Mako looks like it's ready to go. I feel like we could bring that back with us, to be honest. Helen M. Lowe. Ashley, why are they doing this to me? Alexei Dubyansky. Monica Negulesco. Oh, look. That's where my locker was. Borden La Flamme. Must be one out here, maybe. Yeah, I see it glowing. I see you glowing. Oh, this is so sad, though. Hector Emerson, 15. There's another box. Mean Barrett. How am I getting up there then? Marcus Greco. Aha. Carlton Tux. One here. Gemin Bakery. N7 helmet? Why do I get up there? Oh, there's the last dog tag. Let's go get the N7 helmet first. Hell yeah. Oh, Shepherd's lost N7 helmet was recovered. That's so sad. that bit where we went to the galaxy map Addison Chase the last one data pad unrecoverable data spoke to the commander about this all these damned aliens aboard the alliance's most advanced ship I just don't trust them especially that damned Asari and Aquarian what does Shepard think this is a zoo do we think Mr. Presley wrote that it says Navigator Presley? Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> it does, it says it. It says it right there. Something, something, something with the Quarian. It seems she's on some kind of pilgrimage trying to improve the lot of her home ship. I can understand that. I would babysit my children or anything. But if she has to be on board, I suppose that's not so bad. Something, something, something for a while now. And I'm taking a look back at past entries in this journal. Something how blind I was at the time. <gasps> oh. This is sad. Oh, he's a changed man. I came on this ship firmly believing humanity was on its own in the galaxy. Shepard brought all these aliens on board and there's no way we could have accomplished what we did without them. I am proud to say something something die for any member of this crew regardless what world they were born on. Okay. I like that they put in that little redemption arc for Presley because we weren't that bothered about him dying because he was quite judgmental and hateful towards the aliens, but I'm glad they've put that little journal entry in for him. W. Presley. That was a lovely little detail. And now we can move on knowing that Presley was a changed man. All thanks to the Normandy and Shepard's crew. The Mako, unfortunately, doesn't look like it can come with us but I think we put the statue in the right place. The Mako and the Normandy together. That's why I liked Ashley's. Ashley had like a mini redemption too. She was very standoffish with the aliens as well, but by the end of it, she went into battle with the Salarians and she stood with them till the end. Please press F to pay your respects to the Normandy. And now we'll get back to the new and improved Normandy.
Hi, Kelly. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Thanks, girl. Let's go. Admiral Hackett. Oh. From Admiral Hackett. The Alliance was grateful to receive the information you found at the Normandy crash site. We've sent it out to the affected families. By finding the dog tags, you have provided peace of mind for a lot of people. I thank you on their behalf. That's so kind. So Hackett knows I'm alive, exactly. So why hasn't he told Caden? Oh, look, my helmet's there now. That's so cute. All right. Let's have a look at the journal and find one last thing to do. Dr. Morden Solis, biological weapons expert, light weapons training with Salarian Special Tasks Group. Dr. Morden Solis is a Salarian biological weapons expert whose technology may hold the key to countering collector attacks. He is currently operating a medical clinic in the slums of Omega. Talk to Arya at the afterlife for information about Morden Solis. We're heading to Night City, everyone. Okay, so Omega is some kind of space station, I think? Built in the mined-out husk of a metallic asteroid, Omega has been a haven for criminals, terrorists, and malcontents for thousands of years. There is no central government or unifying authority on Omega, and nobody can recall a time there ever was. I like the sound of this place. We're going to see Rogue at the afterlife. This is quite cool. Well, we can bring Kasumi for sure. And Miranda. I really like Charge. Let's have a look at Kasumi. She's used all her points. Miranda's used all her points. So we're good to go. I quite like that it prompts you to do this every time you leave the ship because otherwise I keep forgetting to do it. Welcome to Omega. Fargot. You're new here, aren't you? I can always tell. Allow me to... Oh. A Batarian? Hello, Mocklin. I was just... Leave Fargot now. Oh, of course, Mocklin. Whatever she wants. Blasted scavengers. Welcome to Omega, Shepard. You know who I am? Of course. We had you tagged the moment you entered the Terminus systems. You're not as subtle as you think. Aria wants to know what brings a dead specter to Omega. I suggest you go to Afterlife now and present yourself. Relax. Cut the attitude. I'm not here to cause problems for Omega. Things explode around you, Shepard. You can't blame Aria for keeping an eye on you. Afterlife, now. I'm receiving quarantine warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Edie's talking to us. resistance at the transport station. Anticipate I've also resistance. Oh, messages no. between mercenary groups regarding plans to deal with the Archangel. There's a recruiting station at Afterlife that may have information on him. That's Zaid. That's a person that we're trying to recruit, right? Shut it. I feel like I, I'm being told to go and. Well, we might as well ask him if we're here. Oh, he's beating up Batarians. <laughs> I like this guy. Please. You have to help me. No one said you could talk, jackass. You Zaid Masani? Yeah, that's me. You must be Commander Shepard. Another great I accent. Have a to save. How much do you know? I assume you've been briefed. I've done my homework. He's badass. Cerberus sent me everything I needed to know. My contacts told me we're picking up one man, not two. Batarian delinquent. Pissed off someone rich enough to hire me to go after him, and for my bring him in alive raids, even. Hit Please. my bring him in alive I raids. I said, Shut it. He just booted Tried him to in leave the me face. On a chase all over the systems. He should have known better. These people always run to Omega. What's your relationship with Cerberus? Easy. Cerberus is paying me a lot of money to help you. His armor is awesome. Long and short. Looks like a Krogan shoulder, doesn't it? Suicide mission for the pay. Most mercs don't get an offer like the one Cerberus sent me. This mission doesn't sound like good business, but your elusive man can move a lot of Elusive. Credits. Good to have you, Zaid. 
We have a lot to do. Oh, that was easy. That's what they tell me. I assume the elusive man told you about our arrangement. No, he did not. No. I guess he decided to leave that information out of the dossier. Good thing I asked. Picked up a mission a little while back, just before I signed on with Cerberus. His and eyes are so cool, interested. right? You heard the name Vito Santiago? He's the head of the Blue Suns. Runs the, the whole Blue organization. Sons. Seems he recently captured an Eldfell Ashland refinery on Zoya and is using their workers for slave labor. The company wants it dealt with. We can do that, of course. I'll make sure we get that done. Good. Get it out of the way so we can concentrate on being big goddamn heroes. <gasps> he's, he's making a run for it. Pew! Oh, that was a quick draw. He's like a cowboy. I better turn this thing in before it starts to stink. I'll be locked and loaded next time you're ready to get some killing done. Love that. So he gave me a little side mission there, I think. So that was the veteran, Zaid Masani. He's an infamous mercenary and he's kind yeah, he's given me cowboy vibes. Before he was hired by Cerberus, Zaid had taken on a mission to go to Zoraya and liberate an Eldfell Ashland refinery from the Blue Sun. Once his work there is done, he can dedicate his full attention to the mission. Okay, so we might start the next stream with Zaid's side mission, but for now, we'll continue looking for the professor. We need to go and speak to Arya at the afterlife. Let's go, girls. Afterlife, how cool is it that we're going to the afterlife? Come on, let me in. We don't have to queue, I don't think. Are you expecting me? Kylan? What are you looking at? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Don't you have something better to do than pick fights with people you don't know? No, just the ones who get in my face. You see my gun. Do you really want to do this? I... fine. You're off the hook. For now. He let me see off the around. hook. He let me off the hook. He obviously heard what I did to the last Batarian I bumped into. Let's go after life. Holy shit, this is so cool! drink bottle of brandy chocolate wants a bottle of brandy buy that let's have a drink why not get some for the girls too she didn't even ask you just gestured to the guy that she wants a drink that's hilarious That little head shake she does is hilarious. No more, please. We didn't even need to converse. We just knew. Anto, who are you, Anto? You wanna talk? Talk to Aria. Well, where is she? Where? This is her? Aria. <gasps> she's a, she's an Asari. Holy shit. Oh, my girls have got my back. Stand still. If you're looking for weapons, you're not doing a very good job. Can't be too <laughs> careful with dead specters. That could be anyone wearing your face. Okay. I was told you're the person to talk to if I have questions. They're clean. Batarians have funny ears. Depends on the questions. You run Omega? <laughs> Whoa. I am Omega. Okay, girl. That Batarian totally more. fancies her. Everyone needs more something and they all come to me. I'm the boss CEO queen if you're feeling dramatic. Boss CEO queen. Omega has no I love you, Arya. And only one move. Don't fuck with Arya. She just referred to herself in the third person. I'm obsessed. I have similar rules. Sounds I think like she'll appreciate a little renegade's and flair. And on your ship, that would matter. Here, we entertain my preferences. Is 
So, what can I do for you? Tell me about yourself. Tell me how you got set up here. That's as privileged as information gets. Oh, I have many friends and enemies I keep at varying distances. I don't count you among either. We'll see Shepard's how Shepard's so you. chill. Short answer? Mind your own damn business. Fair enough. I'm looking for Morden Solus. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doctor? Yes. Last I heard, he was trying to help plague victims in the quarantine zone. I always liked Morden. He's as likely to heal you as he is to shoot you. What can you tell me about him? I love when... He used to be part of the Solarian Special Task Group. When Shepard group. just chill. He's brilliant. And dangerous. Just don't get him Tell talking. me about yourself, he never man. Shuts up. I if love you her. really need to find him, take a shuttle to the quarantine zone. No guarantee they'll let you in, of course. What about the Archangel? I'm trying to track down Archangel. You and half of Omega. You want him dead, too? Why is everyone after him? He thinks he's fighting on the side of good. There is no good side to Omega. Everything he does pisses someone off. It's catching up to him. Sounds it's perfect. Just the kind of guy I'm looking for. Really? Well, aren't you interesting? You're gonna make some enemies teaming up with Archangel. That's she is so cool, man. He's in a bit of trouble right now. You guys saying that's Carry On Moss? That's pretty cool. I didn't what know kind she was of in trouble? this. The local Merc groups have joined forces to take him down. They've got him cornered, but it sounds like they're having trouble finishing him off. They've started hiring anybody with a gun to help them. That could be our way in. They're using a private room for recruiting. Just over there. I'm sure she knows everything. Off. She's gonna help. Which Merc groups are after Archangel? Blue Suns, Eclipse, Blood the Blue Pack. Suns. We've heard about they're them. Omega's major players. Saeed just told Unless us about them. Unless they're at war, you'll never see them together. But one thing they hate more than each other is Archangel. Okay, we need to find Archangel and <laughs> protect him. Do you hate Archangel? I don't have time for hate, but I distrust them all equally. For now, I'm happy just to let them kill each other. I appreciate the help. I think that was all See I could if you ask still her feel about. that way when the Mercs realize you're here to help him. So we've asked about Morden. We've asked about the Archangel. We've asked about Arya. Let's ask about the indifference towards me. One scan and we're straight to business. People are usually more concerned about who I am. Your death was downplayed, but hardly what I call a secret. I had to make sure it was really you. That's fair enough. You could have been anyone, anything. Whatever you need will come out on its own. I'm curious, but Omega doesn't really care about you. Yeah, shut up. Tell me a bit more about Omega, so then. you must know what's what on Omega. I am Omega. Everything it's worth knowing. I don't usually give it out freely. Information. I think power. she has a crush on Mundane me. Things Do you, you can guys find think yourself. That? Take a walk in a back alley or buy one of the mercs a drink. Better yet, talk to the entertainers. They give great tools. Just don't waste my time. I did tell her to shut up, but it was in a playful, flirty way. Like, shut up. You do care about me. Of course you do. That's all we have to talk about for now, Arya, but I'll be back. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll be here. See? She's me she's so flirty. Maybe I'll come. Maybe I'll be here. All right, of course you'll be here. Of course you will. Enter the quarantine zone and search for Morden Solus. Where is the quarantine zone? <gasps> Whoa, okay. Quarantine zone. The view of Omega. Omega, what a piss hole. At least it keeps you on your toes. I've had to come here on business before. I feel like I need a shower afterward, in addition to normal decontamination. Aw, it is kind of gross. This is very Blade Runner cyberpunk. Esque, isn't it? Ken Salvage. Ken. Hello there. Might I interest you in some salvage tech? Every credit goes toward a ticket to get me off this forsaken rock. I buy a lot of parts and equipment. Maybe we can make an arrangement. Oh. Well, you seem like a decent person, but you can't breathe a word of it to Harrod. Of course. Then we have a deal. Maybe I'll at least sell something to you. Why are you here, what Ken? What about a nice kid like you to Omega? My pilgrimage. What money I had got stolen within a few days. No. So I decided to sell salvage parts. You can see how that turned out. 
Harrod's forcing me to sell high, and I can't even afford a ticket out this station. Bless him. I could pay your way and get you off this horrible place. How much do you need to get off Omega? I still need 1,000 credits to pay my way. That's quite expensive. I couldn't let you do that. This is my mistake on my pilgrimage. It's my problem. How much do I have? Tell me about Harrod. Why does Harrod control your prices? Why do I want to Harrod made me give this dude undercut him, no a whole what. bag? He was here first, so it's his right. But well, no one will buy from me when he's so much cheaper. I can't save enough money for a ticket off the station. I'll have a talk with him I before we give him a thousand credits. You. Get him to ease up. I won't stop you. If you can convince him to lay off, then maybe I'll get off this station after all. His shop's up the ramp near where Marsh sells his goods. Anything you can do will be much appreciated. Harrett is who we're going to speak to. Please check with my kiosk to see what I have for sale. And thank you. All right, Ken. We'll speak to Harrod at some point for you. I like the city of towns. The prettiest. They value their light. They don't have god awful neon everywhere, like Ilium or the Citadel. I like Just neon. Just the light of people living, moving from place to place. Just enough to know people live there. What is he? Leave, human. Tell Captain Gabon we not kill anyone today. Vorka? I don't know a Captain Gavorn. Why would I tell him anything? Not trust you. Tell that Gavorn is nightmare fuel. Tricks. We not kill anyone today. There seem to be a lot of Vorcha on Omega. Vorcha. Go away. Talk too much. Gavorn's box get no more. We leave. Good talking to you. No more talk. We know Gavorn's tricks. We leave. Okay, bye. Okay. Proper little trolls, aren't they? Whoa, oh, this place is horrible. Is that the shuttle? Ben. And humans. A blight on galactic purity. You, sir. You are a blight. You. And you, human. And you. Prothians wow. cast off the lesser races. The Krog, the Vorja, and the humans. And so they dwelled in filth, on worlds made of dirt, feces. And there they lay until they stumbled into the skies. The lesser races will be our downfall. The word is clear. You are all a blight this way. And Quarantine zone, let's go. I told you to get Let lost, me in. lady. The plague has the whole zone quarantined. Nobody gets in. I'm human, you ass. Is that Kelly? Humans can't get the Looks plague. Looks exactly now like let me Kelly. Get stuff out before looters get it. This thing affects every other race out there. We're not taking chances. Nobody gets in until the plague has run its course. We're going in, excuse me. So you're saying the slums are completely sealed off? Finally, a human that can hear. Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. Meow, meow, you can't meow, keep meow. Me I'm gonna lose all my stuff. We'll go get Doing your stuff. You a favor, human. Anybody in the quarantine zone will be dead from the plague of the gangs in a few weeks. I didn't think Omega had any kind of law enforcement. Exactly. Who gave the order to quarantine the slums? Fresh off the transport, huh? Arya. Arya Tilok calls the shots around here. She's got her little blue hands on every business in this district. And a plague is bad for business. She hired us to keep anyone from entering or leaving the quarantine zone. I'm going in for Morden. There's a Solarian named Morden Solis in the slums. I've got to get in there to find him. The doctor? Yeah, crazy bastard opened the clinic in the district a few months ago. The Blue Suns weren't too happy when he moved in. I hear Morden's trying to deal with the plague. I wish him luck, but the area is still locked down. We have to go Our in, I'm afraid. to wait until either the plague or the Blue Suns kill everyone. Then go in and clean up. Wow, okay. Let me investigate some more. What is the nature of this plague? Tell me more about this plague. It starts out as a cough, then you start coughing blood, and, well, then I shoot you. Fair it enough. It affects multiple species, Turians, Solarians, Krogan, you name it. Only humans are immune, and Vorcha, if you count them. An airborne disease that takes down multiple races, can't let that spread. Hence the quarantine. I understand, but I really do need to get in. I didn't think diseases could cross species barriers. Turians and Solarians can't even eat the same food. Right. Most people figure that it has to be synthetic. Wow. Somebody engineered it. And it either got loose, or they're testing it here. 
And seeing as how humans are immune to the plague and doing a fair bit of looting, a lot of people think humans made it. Maybe the doctor did it himself. Listen, you're stuck here till this quarantine's over. That could take weeks. What you really need is to get this problem solved right now. That's what I do. Solve problems. Let me in and I'll get this district straightened out. You think you can fix this? Why not? Quarantine is more to keep infected people in anyway. I'll radio ahead, tell them you're coming in. Perfect. Wait, you're stopping me, but not them? You son of a bitch. Whoa. You don't have a grenade launcher, lady. <laughs> Get lost. You don't have a grenade We're launcher, here. lady. The won't affect us. Let's do it. Let's go, girls. Oh, we got guns up. Move, girls. Clear to come in. Don't shoot me. Y'all good? Friendly? They don't want to talk. That's understandable. Good luck in there. Blue suns and vorture shooting anything that moves. Oh god. We're gonna have to shoot lots of vort vorcha. Shields have failed. Regain health, regain health. Impression. Friendly fire. Sorry, Miranda, I've I shot seen you. A lot of bad before. This is worse. Way worse. Burning Terrian victim. Human. Should have guessed. <laughs> bad enough you infect us with this plague. Now you have the decency to even wait until I die before you come to steal my possessions. That's not what we're doing. <laughs> Is there anything I can do for you? Get away from me, human. Whoa! <laughs> Your kind has done too much already. Your plan We didn't do this. Me. Your faint pity is the final insult. I need to find Morden Solace. Humans looking for the human sympathizer. Human sympathizer. <laughs> I hope the Vorture burned Morden and his clinic to the ground. <laughs> I hope you... <laughs> I hope... <laughs> Damn it. Damn you. Hey, stay with me. This won't cure the plague, but it might help a bit. I'm sad I missed the renegade option earlier. I think it was going to be to like smash up some pieces of his art. Oh, you, you help me. Why? It's what I do. I don't know if I can find a cure for this plague, but I'm going to try. What? Well, we're Your busy, Shepard. We can't find a cure for a sincere. plague. <laughs> Maybe it's the fever. But as you said. What have I to lose? What do you wish to know? Why are you so convinced humans are behind this outbreak? The plague is too potent to be a naturally occurring virus. Airborne transmission across numerous species, near perfect. Yeah, it does rate, sound a little bit too to suspicious, right? I don't think it, it was the humans, humans though. The species not affected. I feel like it was probably the one, one that he just described conclusion. as the human sympathizer. It's probably the Salarian fellow we're going to visit. Aren't the Vorcha immune to the plague? What if they spread the virus so they could take over the district? Vorcha are immune to disease. <laughs> A human created plague wouldn't affect them. But if the Vorcha created the plague, why wouldn't it affect humans? Besides, the Vorcha aren't smart Fair enough, enough. <laughs> to make a virus like this. They're scavengers. <laughs> Sorry, human. You may not want to believe it, but all the evidence points to your species. Tell me a bit more about Morden. I need to find Morden Solus. He has a clinic on the far, far side, side of, of the, the district. district. Okay. He's taking in refugees, offering to help those infected with the plague. I was afraid to go to him before. He is dangerous. But perhaps he can help. Okay, goodbye, go. Batarian goodbye. friend. No shield. Heal up. Oh my god. She teleported over there, that was so cool. Up ahead! There we go! They seem to be fighting each other. Oh my god, a dog! 
Taking cover instead of just standing there and letting them shoot me. Watch out! A Krogan! Wait, it looks like a Krogan. And then what? And then what? You die? Let's try charge on this dude. Nice. Krogan charging. Krogan charging where? Go go. Let's get him. We've crossed into nice. Vulture territory. The Blue Suns got pushed back way more than I thought. The Vulture might be close to ending this war. Okay, it looks like we're at the clinic. Clinic we're receptionist. Oh my god, there's sick people everywhere. Gross. Professor, we're running low on some oxygen. Use Melanorin. Plenty on hand. Almost as good. Causes I hear him, Morton. Supplement with Have we not? Senazine is the catalyst. Is more than not to genetic markers, hard to find, expensive to mass produce. Remember, at the, in Mass but Effect One, one Garrus asked us to kill someone. Demazine, better option. No, no, no. And the guy was Demazine, like harvesting humans, organs enough, within option. people. Was that not Morton? That was Salion. Okay, I'm just, I'm getting my my Salarians mixed up with one another. That's very embarrassing. Professor Morton Solis. Hmm. Don't recognize you from area. Too well armed to be refugees. No mercenary uniform. Quarantine. All still Solarians the look the same, though, right? Else. Vorcha. Crew to clean them out. Unlikely. Vorcha a symptom, not a cause. The plague. Investigating possible uses by a weapon. No, no, no. Too many guns. Not enough. Data I'm not going to do the renegade Soldier. option. Not scientists. Yes, yes. Hired guns. Maybe. Relax, Morton. I'm Commander Shepard, and I came here to find you. I'm on a critical mission, and I need your help. Relax. Mission? What mission? No, 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 no. Too busy. Clinic understaffed. Plague spreading too fast. Who sent you? I'm gonna be honest. A Cer Cerberus. Ever heard of an organization called Cerberus? Crossed paths on occasion. Thought they only worked with humans. Why this guy's putting me on edge. The collectors are kidnapping entire human populations. We're gonna find out why and stop them. Collectors? Interesting. Plague hitting these slums is engineered. Collectors one of few groups with technology to design it. Oh. Our goals may be similar, but must stop plague first. Already have a cure. Need to distribute it at environmental control center. Vorcha guarding it. Need to kill them. Why can't anything be simple? Just once I'd like to ask someone for help and hear them say, sure, let's go right now. No strings attached. Where would the fun Life in that be, Shepard? We, we need want. side missions. We all to get what we want. We need fetch quests. That sounded troubling. Yeah. Forja have shut down environmental systems. Trying to kill everyone. Need to get power back on before district suffocates. Here, take plague cure. Also, bonus in good faith. Oh, we have the cure? Dead blue sun's marks may come in handy against Forja. One more thing. Daniel, one of my assistants, went into Forja territory looking for victims. Hasn't come back. Holy shit. Oh my god. If I see him, I'll do what I can to help. Thank you. Told him not to go. But he's smart. Bright future. I hope. I met a sick Batarian. I found a Batarian plague victim near the entrance to the neighborhood. Can you send someone to help him? Hmm. Risky. Blue Suns, Vorcha still battling. District not secure. See what I can do. Any idea where I can find Daniel? No. Heard infected Batarians trapped behind Vorcha lines. Daniel went to help. Warned him not to go. Too dangerous. Patients here need him. Snuck out anyway. Wanted to find him myself. <laughs> Can't this leave the clinic. Hilarious. Have to look after the patients. This guy could read the intro text in time. He could read it three times. 
What do you know about the Vorcha? Cowardly, opportunistic scavengers. Not tactical or aggressive. Scale of attack unusual for them. Suspect Vorcha working for collectors. Distributing plague, collecting mm, okay. data. No proof, but theory fits evidence. Okay, 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 okay. Have you had any trouble at the clinic? Nothing major. Blue Suns came for humans, made threats, killed them before things escalated. Fair. For a doctor, you're awfully calm about taking out a group of mercs. Wasn't always a doctor. Some work with Solarian Special Tasks Group. Okay. Advantage of being Solarian. Turians, Morden Krogan, is going to be the perfect addition threats. to the Normandy. Imagine when we put Morden into the doctor's office with Dr. Chakwas and that bottle of brandy that we picked up for her earlier. Shit's going to go wild. What can you tell me about this plague? Hmm, advanced design. Suspected collectors before you mentioned them. Purpose seems experimental. Destroys respiratory systems with harmful genetic oh, no. mutations. Makes sense to avoid humans. Unnecessary to force mutation on human genetic structure for sake of variance. Why does it make sense? Unnecessary mutations? What are you talking about? Yeah, what Possible are you talking virus, about? Testing viable mutation levels in various species. Horrific, but feasible for collectors. Humans known to have diverse genetic background, wider range than other sapient races. Makes sense as control group. We should go now. Let's head for the environmental plan. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to leave the stream there for this evening. And at the beginning of the next stream, we will cure the plague. <laughs>